previously on the show that has been so aptly and poignantly titled, New Crits on the Block. Yes, my name. I will happily remind you, brother. It is I, Richard, and I have finally done it. People will finally understand the true joy and beauty of a rat amusement park. I have my rats, and they understand me. Maybe perhaps you should meet them. Various rats begin appearing. You start hearing the quiet scurrying across the floor in the distance, in the dark. You hear as they echo throughout the hallway and outbursts Rotilla the Hun. Who did that? Who did that? Who did that? I wasn't it's, looking at my screen. It's Jake, definitely was it not you? Jake's <laughs> shit-eating grin. <laughs> <laughs> Jacob? No. Ben is Ben is poised and ready to just unleash here in a minute, but he's waiting. He's picking his, biding his time here. He's picking his moment. Look at him. Welcome oh. back to oh. Havenport, everybody. It's August 28th. <laughs> National Cherry Turnover Day. Oh. Wait, Cherry Turnovers? Mm. Yeah, it's National that Cherry Turnover happening. Day. Everyone go to Cherry Turnover while you listen to this. Cherry it's turn- also I- Race Your Mouse Around the Icons Day. So everyone on your screen, just pick an icon on the screen and just race your mouse around it. Apparently that's a thing. What? I'm pretty sure all these holidays are just made up, uh, but I'm having fun with them. So I actually well, yeah, I, I, I do most observe of that holiday. <laughs> that is what a holiday is, actually. Yep. It's something just made up. That's true. Yeah. Uh, it's also National Crackers Over the Keyboard Day. A lot of, a lot of, oh, uh, wait, yeah. what? National that's, that's Crackers good. Over the Keyboard. That's why I was asking crackers. you guys what you were eating on the break. I was like, what are you eating over, over the there? Keyboard that's day. not a good thing. Uh, they said it's okay. You can just dust it off afterwards. Yeah, uh, but will you though? <laughs> no. I mean, I will because I'm no, not. Those cracker, those cracker just, crumbs are going to be in there for millennia. <laughs> I don't understand I have, why they have. Why don't they just have the keyboard have no bottom, so all your fingernails and skin and crackers just fall through it to the bottom, and then you can just because mm, there's like skin. a board there that has the electronics on it, Ben. But you could <laughs> so totally then, just make that. I mean, you could you could design a keyboard to not to have, right? It's twenty twenty. Hey, you know what? <laughs> let, let me let me know when you get that. <laughs> no, because I thought about it for infection control reasons at work. Because they're constantly like, "This is dirty. This is dirty. This is dirty. This is a hospital. Everything has to be perfectly clean." And I'm like, "Humans are here. Humans are gross." <laughs> like, and so we're constantly just fighting about how to make things like cleaner. Um, which is you know good that we're just trying don't to have stay a keyboard. Clean. Just do voice to text. This is what I'm gonna have about, a, yeah. I'm gonna have a keyboard that has like a pressure system in it. So when you press a button, just like strong air shoots up. So it just goes. Like that, and so that it gets sounds, all your crumbs out of your keyboard. That sounds horrible. Like you're just playing, and just shit just keeps flying up at you. Okay, but it's out of your gonna... keyboard, though. It's an easy way to clean it. So I, I've actually, I, I came up with this genius thing that I, I remind my coworkers of sometimes, and I say, whenever infection control comes through the hospital, so humble. It reminds me of the hey guys, bad remember guy. This genius thing I did. No, no, it reminds me of bad guys in like movies and video games and stuff, where. Um, it, it it reminds me of the bad guys who like lose their minds in movies when they're like, the only way to get rid of evil is to kill everyone, and right. then nothing can be evil. That's infection control in the hospital. They just show up and they go, we'll just get rid of it, and then it can't be expired, it can't be dirty, it can't be this, it can't be that, because it doesn't exist. And then you get to the point eventually where you go, where is all of our shit? <laughs> like, we can't, I need things to take care of people. And then they're like, well, if it's not here, then it can't be expired. <laughs> I don't have to check the the date if it's not if it doesn't exist. Yeah, uh, and that it, that is infection control at the hospital. So I frequently think about how to make things cleaner there. Uh, uh, last one, infection. Control? I actually doing four today, four holidays. It is oh, National wow. Power Ranger Day. Oh, oh, oh yeah! Happy Hanya, and, guys! Happy yeah, Hanya. I was all about Power Rangers <laughs> as a kid. Who Me wasn't? Too. I, I wasn't. It. I wasn't. Um, well, you suck. Yeah, you do. I liked them. I wasn't. My brother was obsessed with them, though. I had the little gloves, the little gloves with the little, 
ch- in the button in the thumb. So when you would chop, it would make a chop sound. Oh, like the, a toy. Yes. I thought you meant like <laughs> yeah. a show. I'm like, that. what are you no, talking there about? There were special <laughs> gloves that you could buy in the color of your ranger. And they mm-hmm. had a little button inside between the thumb and the like palm of your hand. So when you went to do a chop, it would go. Psh! And it was really cool. <laughs> uh, Joe and I cool. were using them constantly. <laughs> I wasn't allowed to play with those. So. No, those are ours. <laughs> 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 you didn't get assigned a ring. Sorry, I, just got, I got hand-me-down toys. You got to be the robot. What was his name? That was you. Oh, oh wait, not, it's not a robot. Bird. It's like a head. Oh, no, no, was, no. And here we go. Zor, uh, not Zordon. It's the other Zoran? One. Zordon was the head, was and the, the robot, guy. I think, had an A yeah. in it. Ah, yeah, 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 guy. That's what he would alpha? say. Oh, was it Alpha? It. Very alpha. good. Yeah. I forgot there was a robot. So it turns out Power Rangers has like a really turbulent history. If you actually go and look up the original like show, there was all kinds of stuff happening. I think one of them did porn. Uh, another one Ranger, was yeah, like, did. another one died in a car accident, um, who I think was the Yellow Ranger. And then. Wait a second. Yeah. Yeah. And then uh one of them, uh Billy the Blue Ranger, got picked on like incessantly, I believe for being gay. I don't remember the specifics, but there was definitely like at one point he wanted to like quit and he had to like go to therapy. Uh when I used to work in the prison system, I was in the same area where they housed um Skylar D. Leon, who uh That's wild was, to me was uh convicted of murder of two people on a yacht he also was on the show but uh, not the original he? though he wasn't an, an actual power ranger but he was on the show at one point yeah um as Did like an you know extra bill Hader voiced uh the robot alpha five jesus christ no. wait, wait, wait when though when, and what what iteration the movie of it? or yeah, yeah. I don't there's know. no he's, way it's the he's show on the bill for he is on the bill, the bill. <laughs> well it's like credits on, yeah the credits <laughs> The, pl- the, yeah, the play bill <laughs> yeah Movies. build for bill yeah just wild power there's Rangers, no man. way it's the original not 90s man yeah. no i don't think it's the original i'm just saying i didn't know he even touched it oh he touched it all right he was bb8 <laughs> too we knew that that we knew well that just makes sense well, so he just he just plays robots huh he's good he's at good robot sounds he's good <laughs> guy's good <laughs> guy's all right good uh, so when we last left off, uh, you guys got in a big fucking fight uh, with your uh, with David, your long lost uh, now where rat turned brother, Richard Rattenborough, who called a bunch of rats in to uh, attack you. And then they all rolled terribly and you suffered very little to no damage. Um, this has That's been right. a pretty one sided fight. However, the episode ended with Rotilla the Hun coming bursting out of a nearby storm drain and charging at you a big, beefy-looking um, uh, were-rat uh, that looks real fucking dangerous. I had a rat growing up. Yeah, he used. To, I had two rats. Uh, one of them was really nice, and his name was Oreo, and he was friendly to me, and the other one always bit me, so I never named him. Uh, he's an asshole. <laughs> That's probably why he was so mean Maybe to you. Maybe if you named him, he wouldn't have bitten you. I thought about naming him, and then every time I picked him up, he bit me, and I was like, fuck you, I'm not going to name you. <laughs> I had rats, too, when I was a kid. I loved my rats. Tobias was the sweet one, though. There's always one mean one. Isn't Tobias from animals. something? It's from Animorphs, yes. I was about Mar- to say... Yeah. <laughs> I had Marco and Tobias. They're the two characters from the Animorphs. Okay. <laughs> uh, Marco and then- was mean. And we're just going to get right back into it. Let's get this combat over uh, or have this thing rip you to pieces. We're going to find out which. Uh, when we last left off, Rotilla the Hun had just gone. He charged at you guys, but he didn't make it all the way there. Um, what he does do, however, is he uses his bonus action to rage. Uh, so as he enters the fray, he looks real fucking angry. Um, almost like he has a level in Barbarian. Yep. Top of the round, it is Richard Rattenborough's turn as he, uh, as his colleague uh, shows up, colleague, so to say, uh, and he, uh, you see him, he smiles menacingly as he does this. Uh, let's see, currently, uh, Rattilla the Hun is blocking him from making a clear shot. If he shoots through people, he's going to have to take a penalty, so uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, and then... Uh, we'll leave him right there excellent so he moves up to the corner of these two sewer grates and as always he takes a shot right at david because he's still really mad at you and wants to kill you uh sorry sorry matt he's just you know he hates you yeah that's fine and he rolls a six well 
it continues. That's not you know what I'm going to do. Hey, you see this dice right here? Yeah. There it goes. Oh. <laughs> what? Where are you, where are you putting that? that? Don't know. I just threw it off the fucking screen. It went somewhere. I have to find that later so my kids don't choke on it. I would All love, right. I would <laughs> love I if it rolled a 20. <laughs> yeah, what if it rolled a 20 now that it's I in don't the know. It fell in the diaper box. I got to go check uh, later. <laughs> I'll Gross. let you know. Uh, the clean diaper box. I don't Ew. know. <laughs> I throw the dirty ones away. Uh, and yeah, he tries box, yeah. He tries to shoot you and he misses because he's pathetic. Um, yeah, Jesus really. Jesus Christ. Soot, it's your turn. Okay. Good luck. Um, I'm I park. So real I'm... quick, I believe that you're is... I'm covered um, in rats, if I remember correctly. E... So is Gush, I think. Yeah, Gush and yeah. you are both covered in rats. So you just have tiny little rats crawling all over you guys. Okay, I am going to use a sneak attack. And I so who are you attacking? Your rats or the other rats? My own rats. Yes, sorry. Uh, okay, here is attack one. So you're going after... A 15? The rats from the Secret of Nim are the ones you're going after. Uh, 15 hits. Okay, and then here's my regular damage. That is a six. And my sneak attack damage is a four. So total 10. Okay, you want to hit it again? Just I do. Just do your damage at once. Uh, do I have to hit it again? Yes. Oh, that's <laughs> that's usually how that works. <laughs> no, <laughs> for free. I, you get it for free. Yeah. No, I, I I rolled the wrong dice. Hold on. Okay, that is a seventeen. That also hits. The damage for that is a four, but I don't get sneak attack on that. Right. True. So you did a total of uh, fourteen damage. Cut it in half to seven. Uh, that puts you right there. Okay. It looks like you sliced a few rats off. Very good. Uh, anything else you want to do? The say shoo shoo go away rat <laughs> um christy i wanted to tell you this uh we were we were playing diablo a couple days ago and i was going to tell you this but uh i decided to save it for the the podcast just so you know you are my favorite character so i'm sorry yeah i'm sorry i keep killing you i love stop, soot i love her accent <laughs> oh thank you um, uh and uh, i really hope that your bad choices and and uh combat don't get her killed <laughs> <laughs> or them killed because uh, no. I really don't want to kill them but I fucking will um, stop it <laughs> if my dice will roll decently for once rare snow you're up um okay well uh snow just leaves the campaign uh because he's no longer he, he's just doesn't feel welcome no I, I didn't I'm gonna say that I didn't like your character I just said that yeah, I really he's sexually enjoyed... attracted to your character Jake so yeah Oh, well, this no, is I'm a not a goblin. There. No, I'm not a goblin. This is no, a kill, marry, right. fuck kind of situation. <laughs> <laughs> kill my rats, marry Christie's character, and fuck Jake's cat. Please take your turn. <laughs> Cats, you did, get away. I have three please, of them. Please, please stop that. For, uh, all of a sudden, the all of a sudden, all the cats yeah. in the background just start <laughs> spilling out of the room. Well, I'm glad that Ben did that because I think that that finally takes the heat off of my FMK, which was between all of the uh, classic monsters from horror films. And yes. I had a lot of people question about my choices, but I still stand behind them. But now it's going to be Ben. Now you're the. Now yeah. you'll see how it feels, Ben. Now you're the weirdo, Ben. Now you're the weirdo. Was. Yeah, I don't think. <laughs> He was. <laughs> this was never questioned. <laughs> so please go. I mean, um, uh, okay. Snow. Uh, no, Snow, please go. <laughs> okay. Uh, I attack the uh, rats that are on uh, Soot. They think it's the Secrets of Nim rats. Yep. Um, so I am going to strike upon them with my rapier. Uh, you're just going to turn them into like little shish kebabs like, and get a whole bunch nice. on the stick yeah. and then hail it over the fire. All right. So I can roll the four plus five. <laughs> well, that doesn't do it. Uh, you want to try again with your offhand? Yeah, I'll try again with my Diaga. Diaga. Like well, Rush. guys, that's even worse. Uh, that's oh, a two yeah. plus five. <laughs> uh, okay, <laughs> so um, no, Jake. you. I guess it would be really hard to like skewer a rat with a rapier as it's crawling all over someone's body. Um, yeah, I didn't want to hit you. Just be glad yeah, I didn't roll get, a crit one. All right, you want to move? Feathers. Um, I will. Now, see, they're all on top of them. Would I still get opportunity to attack if I move? Mm, no. Okay, I'm gonna take just a step back. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh. Excuse me. 
you. Let me just kind of head on out of here. (laughs) I already have the rats all over me, so I'm just, I don't want them again. Uh, It is Radicus Finch's turn, uh, and it looks directly at Gush, and he says, what would you do? Ah, and he rolls okay. He rolls an 11 plus, uh, I think that's a four. Yeah, total of 15. That's a hit. That'll hit it. Look at that. Uh, these things don't do that much poison damage, but they do some. Uh, correct. Uh, Gush, please give me a con save. Ooh, I could see wow, you wanting to one. say Gus. Ooh, at least my damage is good. A good one. What is it? A 19 con save. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah. Yep. Nice. You beat the con save. So you only take a total of five damage, uh, four poison and one um, and Oof. one uh, piercing piercing. God, yeah. poison damage is brutal. Yeah, I'm just going to yeah. get poisoned. Well, you're not getting hit half the time, so you're actually been pretty safe. If I had been hitting you, this would be really doing a lot of damage, but uh, I haven't been. So lucky you. Uh, I was also thinking if a dwarf were to be in this campaign, it would be pretty, pretty OP in this area because they yeah. already take half damage from poison as is. But none of you are dwarves. Um, and the only That's person right. seems to be getting hit by this is uh, there are people with a uh, con saving throw bonus, uh, uh, proficiency. So um, crazily enough, this is just working out. Uh, that was it for them. It is now the rescuers from down under. They are crawling all over, I think, Gush, Gush as Gush. well. Yep. yep, and they yep. go to take a bite at you as well. It's a gush or gush? Gush. Gush, gush, gush. Explaining them, gush. Um, <laughs> gush. Or gush. I don't care. Well, <laughs> yeah. either way, he rolled a 14 Potato plus, potato. so that hits. Nah. Yep. Um, that hits. And these ones actually do more damage because it's a 14. They, they, they have less to hit, but more damage. So they still got you. Uh, that's not bad either. Give me another uh, con saving throw. Oh, man. Six. Mm-mm. Six total. Six total. Uh-oh. That is a fail. You take a total of nine damage, uh, eight Yeesh. poison, and one piercing. Oof. Yeah, that, that's a yep. rough one. Uh, so let's see, 28. Uh, I don't think you've ever 12. gotten healing potions either. Uh, no, you didn't. Um, Wait, I thought we did. I don't, I don't think, think you so. did. I don't think there's an you opportunity also to. You also didn't ask for any potions of cure disease while you were seeing um, while you were seeing uh, uh the the cleric mr first path um so hope you don't get any diseases while you're down here from all these rats biting you anyway uh that's the end of their turn uh it is now david uh david wolfenstein's turn yeah so it's kind of tough to see on the map here where you could, are... uh there is a there is a rat uh here radicus finch okay which is directly north of david and you could hit him there are also rats all over dave uh uh all over gush Okay, well, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get those rats off a of gush. I think. Okay, that they deal most... the most damage when they hit. Yes, they do. Uh, yeah, so you've, two... you've figured that out with good nature checks and just watching them. Yeah. Um, and I they get also have the advantage. lowest AC. Yeah, and I get my advantage on attack here, so that is a two d twenty plus five to hit. Uh, did it roll? Twenty three. That would be fifteen. Oh wait, wait, wait. Be they fifteen were? or because you rolled two d eights plus five, so it totaled it. So it'd be eight is your oh, first roll plus five, and then ten plus your first rolls. Yeah, so fifteen to hit. A fifteen hits, yes, yes. Okay, cool. So two d six plus three for damage is eleven. A six to two plus three, eleven damage. So a total of five damage. Now something uh, I haven't been doing, Ben. They got to roll a con save, baby. To be knocked prone, yeah. Uh, or they get knocked. Aww. Or they get knocked off his sweet little body. Yeah, I guess we could say it gets knocked off his body. Uh, yeah, it's just kind of weird because they're already kind of prone because they're rats. <laughs> they're like as close to the ground as but you can. But they have yeah. disadvantage. But that is days. a that is a like a, a condition. So I guess we'll have to figure that one out. Yeah, uh, sure. So that was um, the rats of the secret of Nim, right? No, that was the rescuers down under. I yes. think. Yes. 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 Uh, I'm, 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 yes, I'm it, keeping track for you, Ben. Don't worry. Thank you. Yeah, it's kind of hard. It's a I got strength guys. save, so hopefully they don't have too much strength. Yeah, not, yeah, not a con, but a strength, little. right? Correct. Uh, they're yeah. little rats. Save. They're not very strong, and they yeah. rolled a s- four. <laughs> that's a that's a fail. Nice. Thirteen uh, DC. Okay, so let's just try to keep me honest. Uh, the rescue is down under our prone, so you kind of knock them off their body, but he's all they're all over his like feet. Sure. Uh, okay. Uh, anything else you want to do, David? I'm still going to stand. Okay, but well, I'm just going to stay right here. 
Uh, that's it for David's turn. It is now the rats of the secret of Nim. They try to attack um, uh, Soot. Soot. They're crawling all over her. Uh, they rolled a 19 plus. That does it. Um, oh, I'm so happy. And give me a con save. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm so uh, glad I'm, I'm back here, man. This is great. Yikes. Ouch. Oh, I got the 21. Very nice. good. Uh, so nine poison cut in half, four plus the one piercing, a total of five damage uh, okay. to Soot. Uh, once again, Soot's Ouch. starting to look kind of hurt. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> they're getting really um, into my feathers guys really getting in there yeah i, tr I tried Please. i'm sorry <laughs> that's my bad uh gush it is your turn okay oh I'm uh, going... yeah that's it that's it for their turn okay okay i'm going to attack the rats that are all over me uh got it so and rescuers down under and they are prone so they are they're at disadvantage does he get advantage with that yeah a melee attack to a creature within five feet you have advantage yeah okay if they're and now if they're farther away than five feet, you get disadvantage. So I get to roll both my range. attacks twice, essentially. Take the yes. best. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So roll advantage on both attacks. You Okay, so that first attack, the first roll is an eight. That's not gonna do it. Second one is a nineteen. I'm sure that does okay. it. Okay, first one hits. Why don't you roll damage on that one? See if you kill it. I don't think you will, but give it a shot. Yeah, it's a six total. Okay. Nope, that didn't do it. But okay. it does look like uh you've killed more than half the rats. Okay. Second and attack. Weaken them. That's an eleven total. To hit? Yes. That hits. Nice. And you're rolling with advantage? Yes. Yeah, so let me do it again. No, that was just a twenty one total. Great. You still hit. Yep. Uh oh, that's a little better. Eight damage. Oh wow. So four. Uh so four. Okay. Six. Yeah. Uh all right. You uh those things are there looks like there's about six rats left on the ground. Uh anything else you want to do? Um no. Okay, Rotilla the Hun then uh, starts barreling forward of 5, oh 10, 15, 20. Um, I guess it can be in... Yeah, this space right here. It can move in. It's difficult terrain either way. Uh, so it moves into the muck and grime, even standing in the sewer directly in front of you guys. You've all been kind of perched on the edge of these of this sewer, and the rats are kind of like coming across it, almost like you're using it like a moat. Um, you've been you standing your ground there. This hulking were rat jumps into this moat and somehow still stands taller than the character. It is standing directly in front of, which is soot. No, -uh. um, no. You just. I'm way just... back here. No, no, you're, not. <laughs> you're right in the front. <laughs> no, the map, really right. the map didn't load. The map didn't load no, again. Yeah. No, on my screen, she's, no, she's so on far my back. Screen, I'm, I'm, I'm really far back so on my screen. It had bonus uh, action raged last turn. Oh no! Um, but it didn't. Bonus oh, action. Wait, yeah. But it didn't yeah, attack it anything. Not. I yeah, know, I know, I did so. that wrong. Uh, so Lassus Rage. I, yep. Yeah, but I, I guess they can do that multiple times. So yeah, they can just expend another one. Yeah, it just expends another one. I forgot how barbarians work because I don't, I actually do play one. I'm an idiot. Anyway, um, I got a lot going on here. Uh, so uh, here's what it can do. No. An interesting concept. It can attack twice. Mm -mm, one of them can be a concept. bite that deals terrible poison damage. Or it can attack with its claws, and if both hit, it can rend and deal additional damage. Um, let's go with the bite. So it attempts to grab onto you and attempts to bite you um, and deals. Oh God. It bites no, its it misses. It rolls <gasps> a three. It three bites plus... one of the rats instead. <laughs> <laughs> you fool. Yeah, it managed. It, 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 it was going to bite you, and then it sees one of its little baby rats on you, and it's like... <gasps> No, Charlie. And it can't uh, uh -huh. manage to find purchase on you. Uh, it can only bite once. The other one's in a claw. Oh, there we go. 18 plus. So that hits. Uh, oh. 1d8 plus 3. Where are my d8s at? Here oh, we no. go. R.I.P. Uh, 6 oh, damage. Boy. It's good okay. to know, yeah. Still kind of standing, but don't know how. Yeah, it, it tears into you with one of those claws. Um, and feather feathers, blood, and rats just uh, go everywhere. Um, and that is the end of its uh, turn. Oh wait, I said six. Sorry, it has an extra plus two damage because of the rage. So actually, it's eight. So sorry, you are still standing, but good God, you're looking hurt. Um, so that's actually a total of eight damage. Uh, so you're down to two HP. 
Yikes. Oh, boy. Top of round three, Richard, uh, or is it round four now? I don't know. Anyway, Richard Rattenborough <laughs> uh, once again uh, loads up its crossbow. He just does not want to get into the fray, and he shoots at David again. This is his go-to move, uh, and he rolls a three again. He then takes the crossbow and just throws it into a fucking sewer drain. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> because it's useless uh, um jesus christ uh all right that was the end of his turn he doesn't even move uh well actually does he uh yeah he runs away oh interesting all right so yeah scaredy he, cat he, wait he, he runs back scaredy into rat. the sewer drain scaredy that rat. Ortilla the hun came from and he vanishes off the screen uh that is the end of his turn uh soot you are technically alive what do you want to do uh Ugh. Okay, so I have the rats on me. How are they looking? Uh, the rats on you. Those are the um, rescuers down under, I think. Yes. No, those are the rats from the Secret of Nim. My apologies. Yep. Uh, they're looking healthy-ish. Now, I have a question. Yes? There's an action called disengage. Yeah. If she disengages while they're on her... Can she, she can move out of them. Yes, I would yeah. like to do that. How yeah, far I mean, they, you specifically are made to do that as a rogue. I, I don't want to penalize yeah. you for some weird mechanics I built. So yeah, you can totally just move out of there. Okay, how far can I go? My uh, 25 feet is 25. how far you can move. Okay, I'm going to disengage back here. I guess okay. <laughs> Jesus. Very she, get, far away get away from, from me. <laughs> oh, weird, and some rats come out of the sewer right behind no, you. Um, you said there weren't any over there. The rats cast rat teleport on top of you. Uh, yeah, you kind of brush them off you and just yeah, yes. and just take uh, off. With that disengage, can I still pop off a shot or? You still have your action. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'm going to do that. Okay. So I will shoot with my short bow. And I think you still get, you can get an opportunity or a sneak attack on any of those creatures. There. Yeah, you could still sneak attack those, those okay. any of those creatures. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, the yeah, I guess I'll go for that swarm. Um, okay, oh, the rats. I'd go for the one that are on Gush, maybe. Yeah, whatever. Get those off of him. They all have to be killed. Yeah, I'm gonna do yeah. that. I'm gonna go for the ones on Gush. Okay. Um, so that's the nine to hit. A nine? No. <sighs> nine. Um, you are Oof. attacking. <sighs> Are it's they still not. Prone? Uh, it's the other one. Oh, she's oh, but she's far away though. So DVD if they less. were prone, they would actually be a disadvantage. Yeah, but it doesn't yeah. matter. You missed anyway. So yeah. All right. well, sorry, it would it, that would have missed everything. Just so you know, so it didn't matter right. what you chose. That that okay. that doesn't hit anything. Uh, nope. I guess that's Soot's turn. Uh, that's mine. Rare snow. Let's go. Okay. Do something. I'm, I'm gonna. Oh, yeah, I hope I can. Uh, Don't I'm forget, gonna... Rotilla the Hun is right there, and he looks real fucking angry. Uh, and it's very healthy, but um, there's all the little other guys too. Yeah. And you said the the rats from the Secret of Nim, they're looking pretty healthy. Uh, they should have yes. taken some ham damage. They've taken some damage, but they're they're not they're not below half HP yet. Once they go below half HP, they get half their damage because there's half the rats. They still deal full damage. Okay, I'm gonna. Something step. to think about. If you if you take out half of their HP, they become half as powerful. I'm gonna step up and take an attack with my rapier on the rats of uh, the secrets of Nim. Got it. Um, Roll above a ten. Actions. I'm not even trying to hide these things. ACs. They're so low. Mm, that is a crit twenty. Nice. So twenty Holy plus five. Holy moly! Yikes! And okay, this is that also gonna be a. Oh man, I really That's wish I did freaking. The other guy. Um, oh, well, you know. Hey, here's the thing. These things take half damage, so critting them is not a bad thing. You yeah. need to kill them. So okay. uh, what do you got? Give it to me. I'm wondering if I should Give sneak attack on these guys Give just it to, to me. get Give it to rid me. of them. Yeah, I'm gonna. So I'm gonna do a sneak attack too. Just I'm just gonna wipe these guys out. Now, sneak hopefully. Oh, this stuff. is no. This is the right time. Crit this thing with a sneak attack. <laughs> okay. Kill so it. So there's that. that. So that is. Uh, two, a seven, and a three for twelve, and then my sneak attack damage. I have to roll four d six. So 
Let me, oh God, thank God, because that's only a f one and a four. Okay, so total damage is 25. I okay, got a 12 with my rapier, five and eight. So cut in half, that's, that's uh, 12 damage. Uh, it looks like there's about five rats left. They look, uh, you you wiped Shit. out a bunch of them with a big, like like once once you, you see the thread, you know what I mean? Like all of a sudden your 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 view. That was a demon slayer reference for you, Jake. I know. You thank see you. the uh, you see that <laughs> perfect opening where all of a sudden all the stars align, and with one thrust you go through like like twelve of them, and they're all on the end of your rapier, uh, yeah. wiggling around, squirming. Um, I, sm I can smell the thread. The right attack. Ew. Okay. Um, I'm going yeah, to... you really hurt them. You still have your bonus attack. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Uh, that is a 9 plus 5 for 14. That hits. Excellent. Give me some this damage. This is going to be a lot, though, because... Every little bit helps. It's a game of inches. Not, not bad. That is... No, I can't remember. I'm not adding my... No, bonus. you don't have any extra bonuses. Cause... Okay, so this is 4 damage, then. So okay, 2 damage. Two. All right, you take out another two, a couple of them. Um, Excellent. I you don't moved think I and you move. used all your stuff. You could, you moved one space forward. So if you move away, I, um, think, I, I think the rats of Nim would have an opportunity, right? Because they're not. Well, they're not on, on you. So yeah, I wouldn't worry about it. Okay, well then, if you're gonna say that, I'm gonna 100 percent take a few steps back because <laughs> I've kind of decided they can only attack you if they're on you. Okay, well I'll take. They have like on. they have zero reach because they're a rat. You know what I mean? Like a tiny rat. Actually, I'll stand, on you. I'll stand in front just to kind of block think. from soot. Yeah. Okay. Please, thank you. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, I was going to let you know, technically, if something were to charge up, it could still get to soot without leaving your range. There okay. you go. That'll do it. That actually protects her. Very good. Uh, good tactics. Good tactics, everybody. Um, that is the end of Rare Snow's turn. Uh, it is Radicus Finch's turn. He bites at Gush. Block using it. this dive that's been fucking me. Natural 20. There it is. Oh, there it no. is. Throw that one away. Um, Throw that one in the diaper. <laughs> boo. So Radicus Finch does 44 damage of poison. Good luck. Give me a con save, Gush. You're the, you're the best person for this. Oh, please do good. 15. Oh, that passes it. Thank good God. job. And he actually rolled really good. He rolled uh, two fours, a three, and a two. So four, eight, ten. 13 uh so half of that is six plus one so a total of seven damage to gush um yeah uh it's almost like oh you're also looking really bad uh yep. yeah okay well i made that decision so here we go <laughs> um we'll be it's fine. almost like getting bitten by poisoned rats is not the best thing in the world for you uh that was radicus finch's turn it is now the rescuers from down under uh, who are also on Gush, and they try to bite him. Uh, you guys are going With to need some healing. Uh, well, they stand up. <laughs> no. And they crawl back on you. So it helped for hitting them. Doesn't so much help for attacking them. Uh, Gush, that is a natural one. Oof. Yay. Do they bite themselves? No, yeah. they just... <laughs> they, they're embarrassed. So Where's they their leave. fumble? I want a fumble roll now. Uh, that that's entire combat has been a fumble for me, is, is <laughs> what's her. going on here. Um, so yeah, no, oh God, good fucking luck. I, I was like, ooh, okay, maybe they actually are in trouble here. The sheer numbers is the threat. Uh, all right, that's the end of their turn. Uh, it is David's turn. Hey everyone, it's your favorite player, man, and welcome to this week's middle break. Now, if you all don't know what that is, that's the NFL football theme because it's football time again, maybe. And if you didn't know, I'm a huge sports fan. Oh, well, I know what you're thinking. He likes D&D. &D, he likes sports. He likes music. What else could he possibly like? Well, <laughs> funny you ask, because we like it when all you listeners out there help us grow our podcast. And there's a couple ways that you can help us do that. Let's go through them right now. The first way, of course, subscribe, rate, and review to our podcast wherever you get our podcast from. 
Google Podcast, Apple Podcast, Spotify, whatever podcatcher you use. You're obviously listening to it now. Go to that podcatcher, leave a five-star review, and leave a nice little write-up about why you like our podcast so other people can see that they might be interested too. You can also follow us on all of our social media platforms. You can find us on Twitter at New Crits and on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok at New Crits on the Block. We're always posting content on there, guys. We're posting questions. We're posting stories. We're posting audiograms. We're posting videos. So the best way for you to help us grow there is either tag people in those posts or share those posts to your own profile. Put them in your stories. Put them on your feeds. Just do whatever you can to help us get the word out because right now we're only growing through word of mouth. So doing that helps us more than you know. One of the ways we like to give back to our amazing community is we have made a Discord for new crits. Yes, it is a Discord for all things new crits, but not all things new crits. Of course, you can come in there. I've said, of course, too many times. You can come in there and hang out, talk to the cast, talk to other fans of the show, talk about the show in general, or you can just come in there and hang out with the really amazing community we have started to build and have continued to build over the last few years. It is a safe, inclusive, super chill space. So if you're not part of the Discord yet, what, what are you waiting for? Now, you might be thinking, well, Matt, I want to help you do all these things, but how do I get to all the places that you just mentioned? Well, from our link tree, of course, L-I-N-K-T-R dot E-E slash Nucris on the block. We'll get you to all the places that I mentioned and some places that I didn't even have time to mention. L-I-N-K-T-R dot E-E slash Nucris on the block. It is your central hub for all things new crits. All right, everyone, let's get you back into this week's episode. Thank you once again so much for listening. This week, as you know, we come out with new episodes every single Monday. That ain't stopping anytime soon. So it's kick off. Did someone to say kick off? Ba, 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 da, ba, da, the rest of this episode. And we will see you next week. And until then, be kind to each other. Be excellent. Be safe out there. We love y'all. Bye bye. So here's a problem, gang. I'm the only one who can really heal people. Yep. Problem yep. is, I also have the most hit points of anybody. And there are three pretty healthy things coming at us. Mm -hmm. If I morph out a wolf, yeah. like, there goes well, our you're tank. Gonna, you're going to have to heal us after this battle, unfortunately. But, but what I'm saying is but that we, have, we, make we it... have to make it through this battle. That's yes. the problem. Uh -huh. okay. I haven't been touched yet. Okay, well, then I'm going to... I if I If I morph into a druid... All I can really do is heal like a little bit. And then that one, that barbarian is going to just take whatever I do and just nix it. And then I'll also be in druid form and then I will get crushed. Yeah, no, I, yeah. I think that's I think no that's one's fair. asking you to take. Come no, out of I, there. I'm just yeah. telling you guys my thought process. Yeah, no, no, Matt, okay. Matt, you want to know what I think? Kill things. What? <laughs> As the DM, honestly. Sure. Staying in wolf form is the best choice. Oh, I, I'm, I know. I'm just telling. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm telling my team my process of why I'm staying in wolf form and not like healing people because i don't think we're any of us are questioning that no i yeah, i, no. I, I, that's that's I think i think you're them. doing i think you're doing the right but i get what you're getting at you're like i'm not yeah. trying to not heal people i just need to be a tank yeah yeah, yeah i need to, I need to, to, uh, try right to stay up over here far far away you just come heal me after <laughs> no so, so made a good, eat, soot made a good move rats. she she disengaged when she realized she was going to go down because you can still do as much damage as you normally could do with one hp so, so uh, okay. you guys are playing pretty tactically. I'm proud of you. I, th I um, think now, can I run into the rats? You could. Yeah, you can occupy their space. Okay, because I what, need to get between. What better way to eat them? I know. I need, I yeah. just need to get in front of this guy who could just beeline towards our our little squishies in the back. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get in front of the barbaria rat and get into the swarm here. Okay, David and Wolfenstein attack. just kind of pads his way through the rats with his feet, just stepping yeah. on them as they start climbing up on them, getting ready to bite them. So I'm going to do uh, two rolls like this. That's a nat 20. <gasps> nice. Yes! Oh, good move go. on Rotilla the Hun. That's, uh, that's fucking perfect. Just what we needed. That fucking hits too. And, you know, he's raging, so he's taking half damage, but you know what? Yep. That's, ah, so, that's, so that's two, really good. So 4d6 plus three. Oh, uh, even that comes yeah, out about even. Not so horrible. Okay, six so he takes 16. half damage, so it ends up being eight. Uh, but still, that that takes him down quite a quite a chunk. Uh, yeah. And he just makes make a strength saving throw, right? He does. I was just going to say he's real fucking beefy looking. Yeah, I know, um, but still, we, we could be something. Yeah. And he roll. Oh my god, 
He rolls a natural 20. Ah, yeah, no, he saves. Oh, I'll, t- I'll, take, I'll take that for I'll take that 20. as a swear save. Yeah, <laughs> yeah absolutely. Yeah. <laughs> that's what I'm mad about. I wish I had done that to you with the bite, because that poison bite on that guy is fucking deadly. Yeah. But, ben just wants to murder us before this fucking ooh, campaign's done. So okay. okay. I want you guys to feel threatened is what I want. And I want the we, listeners hey, to think ben, that we you feel might threatened. not survive. I'm threatened. I'm threatened. <laughs> ben, every time we go into a combat and you say, oh, yeah, you guys might die. We trust me. Well, up until so far, it's actually been a cakewalk because I don't know what I was doing. And it turns out I still don't because now I've gone too far in the other direction. But this is what you got. <laughs> uh, that is the end of round. Uh, right. No, it's not. I'm so sorry. It is. David just went. Yeah, it's and I'm going to stay there. I'm not going to move any further. It's okay, the Nim, Nim uh, and then Gush. Yeah, right? it is the rats from the secret of Nim's turn. Um, and Gosh, they are right on top of uh, David Wolfenstein. So they're going to bite his little wolf butt. That's fine. Uh, they rolled a seven plus two. They miss. So they miss. Um, Hell yeah. So they just kind of, they're just kind of hanging off. You got one on each ear, like an earring. And, uh, cool. Uh, hey, don't take my, uh, don't take my good. <laughs> Not again. <laughs> That's my thing. Yeah. They're, well, the ears are the most tender parts of animals. Um, mm. They're so, are they're they? so fleshy. I don't know. I would figure I'm like, not an, I'm not an animal expert. Like your cheeks and stuff. That's why monkeys like go for those first. Ew. Uh, thank you for that nightmare. Gush, it's your turn. Uh, you still got rats though. on you, but they're pretty hurt. There's also Rattilla the Hun there. Uh, and you got multiple right. attacks. You can switch them up. Um. Okay. So I am going to... I still got the rats on me, right? That's correct. Okay. I was, yeah, was going like... to try to go for the rats on you, too. So if you want to... On my turn, that's, what I'm about. that's my first goal, is to get your rats off you. I will remind you that the rats on you are now dealing half damage. Because they have half their yeah. HP, but they can still hurt you, and they have low to hit. All right. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to attack Radicus Finch. Okay. Those things are low HP. Give me a roll. Okay. So first attack is a 22. That hits. Give me the damage. Damage is a six. Six total. Six total. It looks really hurt. Okay. I can finish him. Second. Well, he has another attack. He yeah. has another attack. Yeah. yeah. Do what you want. Second attack. Oof. That's an eight total. Doesn't hit. Doesn't hit oh. anything. So because ah. I took a second attack, do I get a bonus action on top of that? Or no? that is your bonus action. That is the bonus. Okay. Yeah. And you it's added your to hit to it, right? Yeah. Wait, no, is it his bonus action? Yeah. A second yes. attack. Does he have multi attack? Not as a level three fighter. Oh, okay. Then never mind. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Don't you have action church? You could do that. That's... Something well, tells me you guys are going to need to take a short rest after this, and you will regain it after that if you wish to. Uh, well, I was going to use it to do something else, but that's um, fine. It's your character. You do as you please. Yep. Uh, okay. I'll take my action surge, and then I'm going to use my second wind. Oh, I forgot about that. All right. Nice. Very good. Um, so give me a D10 plus three, I think. Yep. One if second. I remember correctly, I'm yep, just trying that's, to... Save. That's exactly right. Yep. Uh, doot. Sick. That's a seven plus three. I get 10 hit points back. Nice. Hey, nice. That hey. is nothing okay. to scoff at in this battle. Nice. All right. No, Gush is no, back on. You, you, he looked like he was ready to back go down, half. and all of a sudden, he just kind of... just kind of popped up a little bit, like... You know, this fight's not over. I, uh, good job. Good job. All right. Anything else you want to do? That's it. Uh, well, that was smart because Rotilla the Hun is up next and he, uh, now, you know what? David Wolfenstein just bit him. So he's going to bite him right fucking back. That's fair. He rolled a 13 plus. I don't have his stats up, but I'm sure it, that it's hits a hit. You. It's a hit. Yeah. yeah. It's, I have a 14 in this, in this. I had a pull stats probably a negative one anyway for to see huh? what to hit. Yeah, th- it's a negative one to hit, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, no, it's uh, it's, it's a plus be. five. It uh, is. It, it yeah, hits. It hits. Yeah, no, it hits definitely. One d four. Okay, so for starters, the d four because it's just a bite, no big deal, just a little bitesy. Oh, we rolled a max four. Yikes. Uh, four, five, okay. six, seven, nine piercing on the bite, and that's Ooh. not the bad part. That's not the bad part. Give me a con save. Okay. You got this, Matt. Come on. Come I'll make on. it open here. The will will the dice. As I have been. Don't do it. Let's see. 20. Only positive vibes. 
21. Yes. Oh, yeah. sorry. It's, a, it's only a plus two, but it's a 20 still. It's you, a 20. you still totally beat it. Uh, okay. 44 poison damage, Phew. but I didn't roll that great. So Ooh. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, half, four, nine. A total of 13 damage to your character, some of that poison. Oh, 13 total. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Not, okay. Yeah. I didn't roll okay. that great in the poison. I'm I'm doing okay here, gang. Yeah. Still, that does take you down about a third of your health. Um, so I still got 21 hit points left. I have written 24. Oh, did I math wrong? I was hit the I last. Math. You did, because I got hit by a few hit points the first time. I don't oh. think you factored those in. I guess I did not. Well, thank you for so, being honest. At 21. Okay, great. Uh, all right. Well, uh, that was one of his attacks, and his second one is a claw. Okay. And he rolls a 12 plus four. It hits. So it that hits. hits. Yeah. Uh, and claws are 1d8 plus three plus another plus, plus five. 1d8 plus five. D8, D8, D8. There you go. Yeah, that's a lot. <laughs> I thought you said 1D8 uh, plus 3 plus 5. I'm like, holy Jesus. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, 1D8 plus 3 plus 2 because the rage. Gotcha. Uh, okay. Total of 10 damage that time. Ooh, Ooh. okay. Damn. So. Uh, All right, well, down to 11 hit points. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you've. That's okay. That's why you did. Hey, you know what? That's why I'd you didn't down. do Wolf. <laughs> yeah, I'd be you, down. You were saying. Um, although I think one of those attacks may have not hit him with your increased AC, but it doesn't matter. That is the end of Rattilla's the Hun's turn. Yep. This thing grabs you with its claws and just sinks its claws into the side of your ribs and reaches Arr. back and just bites you on the back of your neck uh, to assert dominance as the alpha male in this situation. He's more of a beta. Um, no, whatever. Um, uh, well, we're going to fight. I mean, when he kills you, he'll be the alpha. Uh, that is the end of that round. Top of the round. It's back to Richard Rattenborough, who is not here. He does something. He gone. Hi, coward. Him. Runs. Yeah, he he's he's somewhere. Um, and that's the end of that. Uh, so it's your turn. OK, I am going to shoot. Uh, so the rescuers down under are a disadvantage still. No, or, no, um, no. Not? They all okay. stood up. Okay, then I'm going to um, shoot those. And points. I think anything you hit, I think you could sneak attack based yeah. upon yeah. all the pieces. Yeah. Yep. So I'm going to, here's my attack first. Oh my God. An eight. Nope. That doesn't hit anything. Uh, and that's all you can do with a crossbow because it's yep. a one one shot deal. Uh, you want to move or? You're... Mm, nope. Nope. Keep it moving. Rare snow. It's your turn. <laughs> uh, okay. I move up. This time I'm going to do shit. Um, I'm going to hit the ones on David, mm. and then I'll hit the ones on you. Which what which, which which rats look healthier? I'll give you that. Sure. Uh, the rescuers down under look healthier. Those are the ones on Gush. Me. Those okay. are the ones that you would probably need to sneak attack to kill. Okay, so I'll, I'll actually go ahead and attack the ones on Gush first with my rapier. Oh, thank God. That is a, a 14 plus 5, 19. That, that hits. Give me that sneak attack damage. Okay, so my normal damage is 8 plus 3, which is 11. And then my nice. sneak attack damage is another 4, so 15. It, it kills it. Don't worry about it. Woo. Yep, okay. I was doing the math in my head, and I was like, that thing's dead. Okay, um, um, and then I will use my bonus action to attack the ones on... The rats of the Secret of Nim? Yes, on David. Yep. Give me six damage. Come on, you can do it. First hit. Uh, seven plus five for twelve. That hits. Excellent. Yes. Oh god. Okay. Come on. Come on. I need. Roll I think six. I have to roll a three or a you four. You have to roll. A, you have to roll six. I think because you have no bonus damage. To this five total damage. Oh, so, so close. So two damage. Two plus. Right. It's fine. It's not. It's really going to touch me. There is one fucking rat left. <laughs> yeah, um, <laughs> all right. Uh, right. Rare snow. You moved. You used your actions. That's it. Uh, Radicus I, I would Finch. like to back up one again. Uh, sure, you can do that. Uh, Radix Finch, it goes after Gush. Give me that. Give me that sweet half elven meat. Uh, <laughs> that is a fifteen plus. <laughs> that hits. Uh, so oh, sorry. No. Uh, Radicus Finch deals two uh, d four damage plus one for the piercing. Uh, Gush, give me a con save. I got a twelve, man. I keep you did saving it. Saving these things. Uh, three. That's day. Hey, that's why you have con saving throw yeah. proficiency. Uh, that is only a total of three total damage. Beautiful. Nice. So, okay. Just whittling you down. Oh, not two hit points. Twelve hit points. There we go. Uh, all right. Uh, and it is now David's turn. Yes. Okay. First, first, 
I am going to use uh oh where'd it go uh combat wild shape where I can use a spell slot to regain one d eight hit points nice per spell slot extended okay okay so I have one two three four spell slots uh I can't remember do my spell slots regain on a short rest for no. druid I don't remember mm -mm. I don't think so though. no it's only warlocks no. that get that now a reminder when you survive this, assuming that you do, mm -hmm. there's nothing stopping you from taking a long rest minus the potential death of your friend. Which yeah. we're not really, I mean. Something something to think about. <laughs> what? Yeah. what? Her what clock already we... stopped. Right. No, no, it started ticking once you realized she was in danger. Uh, Matt, do what you want. Yeah, okay, so I'm going to use uh, a, yeah, a 1d8 then. I'm going to re redo that. Uh, regain that, I should say. 1d8. Let's roll that. Oh, of course, oh no. Oh. So you literally heal one hit point? Um, yeah. Damn it. Very right. upsetting. Oh, wow. Cool. Uh, something fizzles inside of you. Yeah. Well, okay. But then I'm mad. I'm going to attack uh, Rattel the Hunt again. I would be mad too. He, he pees a little. Yeah. You got pack Almost. tactics, so you got okay. uh, advantage. Yep. I hit. I hit 19 oh, or so 22. So close to a 20, but not that the case. Okay, you hit. Give me that damage. Okay. That's 2d6. It's 3. 8 damage. Okay. He's still raging, so that's half, but still he looks hurt. Okay. Um, that's the end of David's turn, I believe. That is the end of David's turn. The rats of the Secret of Nim who are crawling all over you tried to bite you. The one. Uh, they rolled a 12 plus 2 for a total of 14. That hits, That's a right? hit. Yep. Yeah. Shit. Give me a con save. I need one, okay. one more damage to kill it. Uh, con save has a D plus 2. Nat 20. God damn it. <laughs> Go figure. Uh, <laughs> no. Three damage to uh, David's wolf form. Three? Um, oh, fuck. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You're almost de-wolfed. Oh, boy. Uh... Gush, it's your turn. Lovely. Do something. Do uh, something good. Yeah, so I'm going to attack the rat. Or I'm going to attack Radicus Finch first. Yeah, get him off, off the board. Yep. Oh, no one's gone down yet. That's good. Okay, that's a 23 total. To hit, it's dead. To hit. It had one hit point left. Oh, right. nice. <laughs> Okay. okay, then I'm going to get the rats off of uh, David. David Wolfenstein. It also has one hit point left. Just roll a 10 to hit. Oh, please, please, please. Oh, thank God. Uh, that is a 19 plus five. It is dead. Yes. Okay. Um, For a second, I thought you didn't. I thought you rolled under a 10. I was like, no. Oh, <laughs> no, we can't do <laughs> You only got one enemy left, Rotilla the Hun. All the rats around you are dead. It is big. It is angry. Mm. Uh, it is a master of horseback archery combat and <laughs> was unfairly uh, uh, treated uh, by the annuals of history in regards to its uh, its combat prowess, intelligence, or functionality. Uh, Attila the Hun was in no means a barbarian. He was actually a brilliant combat tactician. Mm -hmm. um, however, in this case, he's a big fucking rat and he's going to try to kill you. Um, anything else you want to do, Gush? Intimidate. If I were to move, would that, yeah, I think, even though you it's get like on the other side of me. it, you could get on the other side of it and flank it. Give uh, future characters flanking. Is that going to be opportunity of a tick? Nope, because you won't leave its range. As long as you stay within the five feet of it. Yeah. In Pathfinder, it's if you leave a square. So this so would I be move op like here? provoking opportunity that would hit. However, in 5e, it does not. And correct. You can move there without. Yeah. So you now have this thing on both sides. You got Gush on one okay. side of it, David on the other. Uh, you're both standing on clear ground. It's in the sewer water and you're hitting it from both sides. Uh, that is the end of your turn, I believe. Correct. Thank you. Yep. Uh, Rotillo the Hun decides it's going to rip uh, the life out of David. So yep. it attacks. Miss, miss, uh -huh. miss, miss. God, roll bad. Roll Come bad. On. Roll bad. Natural one. One. 20. That's a 20. -uh. I, hear, I heard in his voice. <sighs> the 20, right? You look too happy about it. a natural 20. Um, Jesus Christ, that's 8d4 damage. Okay. <laughs> what on earth? Eight because D4. it's poison. Yeah. Because it crit. Oh my god, I just... Well, that's actually pretty even. Two fours, two ones. 
uh, for a you better 10. pass that con save. <laughs> Duh. Uh, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, and it's bite. Another four. 25 damage past that con save. <laughs> DC no 12. Pressure. Now, hold on. When I roll this, don't say anything depending. I will not. Okay, good. I passed. <laughs> <laughs> very good uh so it's tw- uh, 10 plus four so a total of 14 damage uh to mr uh david wolfenstein okay that knocks nine, me out you only had nine hp so your mm-hmm. your real david form takes uh five damage yes okay i think we can take uh so guy. what is your max hp as david 24 so now you're at 19 correct great and your new ac as you've been knocked out of uh form 16 is now 16 so your ac actually goes up so Okay, uh, you are no longer a wolf. He bit the wolf right out of you. Okay. Okay. I don't like that. So there you rude. go. There's your token back. Uh, that is one of his attacks uh, when he bites you, and he's now holding on to you, and he tries to claw you okay. and rolls a natural one. Nice. Good. I am hot or fucking cold today. <laughs> yep. I prefer the cold. I have never rolled yeah. Yeah. so many... <laughs> Polar opposite numbers. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I guess it evens out. Uh, that's the end of his turn. Top of the round, Richard does something. You don't know where he is. So it's your turn. Okay. I am going to crossbow him. Here goes. Yeah. Please hit. A 14. A 14 hits. That hit is, is his AC exactly. Oh, okay. oh, um, I am obviously using sneak attack as well. Very good. There I want is. you guys to win at this point because you're definitely going to win. I just want to see how much damage I do to you before I, okay, I before you do. No one's going to die in this combat. You just think you're safe. Five, you only five, five regular untouched. damage, nine. So 14 total damage. Okay, he's still raging, so that's half. But let me tell you something. He's looking pretty hurt. He's looking like he's okay. more than half hurt. Uh, and he's the only one left. So just start wailing on this thing. Uh, Soot, you want to do anything else? Uh, no. <laughs> Rare Snow, you're up. All right, I'm going to run up onto this bridge. I, th- I thought you are going to do that. You have this thing completely surrounded. You're all standing on dry ground. It's in the sewer, and you're all stabbing it from various angles. This is awesome. Okay, uh, I am going to attack and it's it. Just... And it's just like wildly swinging at all of you, just like roaring and grabbing and clawing and biting. Uh, give me a hit. Uh, one second. I'm just going to pray to the dice gods for uh, 20. Okay. I have prayed. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> it works. <gasps> Did I get it? Fucking 20, baby. Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> 20 plus five. 25 total. It works. And it uses like, its Shut ability <laughs> to make Jake have to roll at disadvantage. <gasps> Specifically, Jake. It's a crazy thing I have. No, right you're here. lying. That's not a fucking thing. I am. I am <laughs> lying. I am lying. Oh, oh, yeah. Shut the fuck up. Gonna be so mad. <laughs> All right. Okay. Roll damage, buddy. So this is for Yay. my just my rapier. Not the best damage. Uh, three plus one plus three for seven, and then my sneak attack is doubled. So let me roll that. That is a four and a five for a nine, and then a two and a four. So total. That is. I lost count. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to. You were at 16 before the two and the four. Okay, so, yeah, so 22. It's, it's seven plus nine plus six, so 16 plus six is 22. 22. Yeah, so 11. So damage. 11 half damage. Um, it's looking very, very, very fucked up. Okay, and oh. that is the end of your. No, no you still I got. One I, got I got one more attack, baby. If you roll Come a on, six, you Jake. kill it. Uh, I know I I I missed my attack. I rolled a five plus oh. five. Oh, damn it! It's okay. Hey, you know whose turn it is? Gush. Everybody at once. Let's do it. Gush, 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 gush. 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 Explode, explode on him. Gush, him. gush, gush. <laughs> explode on him. Oh my god! Please, gush. Because if you don't hit him, it is his turn. No, it's my turn. Yeah. Oh. Oh, I'm so sorry. David, technically, yeah. oh, wait, isn't turn it now. my turn? It should be, it I'm should so be sorry. David's it is turn. David's turn. It is David's. David's turn. Because I deleted you off my tracker, I got all confused. All right. David, go ahead. All right. Well, because I can, I can regain these at short rest. I'm going to morph back into a wolf again and attack him. Okay, you're a wolf again. Boop. I am. <laughs> all right. Two plate, attacks. Plate. One and two. That's 21 to hit. Got it. 
Yes. Deal at to... least six damage. Uh, yeah, no problem. Ten. It is Yay. dead. Wait, let's go. Ten? Now oh. Gush can explode damage. on him. You dealt ten, ten damage. damage. Yeah, five. So yeah, right. That's it. Sorry, I'm mathing in my head wrong. Uh, <laughs> dire Wolf David Scattenborough, also known as David Wolfenstein. How do you kill Rotillo the Hun, who is currently completely surrounded by everybody standing in the shit? That's what I'm Let thinking, because I see this as more of the like scene from a Marvel movie where the three of us are actively taking this thing down. Right. It's not just one Correct. person doing yeah. it. So, you know, I see I see. Hey, you know what, gang? Let's make this a group takedown, huh? Yeah, except, except what do you think? So, so I'm gonna, so I'm gonna jump. Yeah, sorry, so I'm gonna jump what, up me? at. I want at, to help. Okay, you can help. I'm gonna jump okay. up at the rat's neck and just go for the jugular and just start pulling it down so it balances off and is almost ducking down. That's what I do. I shoot an arrow into his eyeball. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, boys. <laughs> what are you doing, Gush? I'm, I'm like golf swinging right at his knees. <laughs> oh, okay. So he's down. So, so wait, he's so wait. Down. There's only there's only Jake left. So here's what happens. Christy shoots it. Uh sorry. Uh Soot shoots it in the eye. Gush pulls it down. Uh sorry, sorry. Uh, uh David pulls it down. Gush takes out a knee, so it's on one knee and it looks up at rare snow. Yep. With his one good eye. I get with his I, one good eye. I get into the shit. You climb down <laughs> in the shit with it. And I just stare into its eyes and I cut its throat. Just the one. The one eye. And you slit oh. its throat. Yeah. Slowly. And it oh. bleeds out as all of you are basically like hanging off of it. And it falls into the shit. I climb back out of the shit. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Good job. And, and you climb out of the shit. <laughs> and somewhere, David's brother, Richard is alive. I'm an alpha, so, you know. <laughs> yeah, you sure are. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Ouch. Hey, how many more string cheeses are you going to eat like a little kid? <laughs> on camera uh, for us. Excuse me, string cheese are for every age, okay? <laughs> just oh. just like Capri Suns, all right? Alphas always need to say, I'm the alpha. Yes, they do. Literally, have you not seen any, uh, like, I mean, look at alphas? They I mean, look at it. I mean, it's actually kind of true. If you look at like an animal planet and stuff, like being the alpha is usually like roaring in another animal's face. 